Hey everybody, Dr. Red here, and we are live with Death Road to Canada. So Death Road to Canada, Canada was a game developed by uh, Mad Garden and Rocket Cat Games, originally kickstarted, I believe, uh, a few years back, if we're being honest. The game was planned earlier, hell, I think it was delayed even a day or two to get it here, but here we are now, and uh, I haven't really played any of this game, so I have no idea what we're getting into, but hell, what the hell, let's get into it, right? So let's see, uh, it's going to be showing me keyboard controls, so hopefully I can figure things out, okay. If anything else, that is hit. Okay, A is pick up, for any of you Xbox controller users here. Looks like we can hold multiple weapons and swap her out, okay. Uh, Z, A, a to talk. Uh, Linwood scenes Keely, who's a real dink. Zombies have broken into my home. This is probably your fault, it's not mine. You found the zombie bunker. Keely called dibs on this big bedroom before anyone else. Leave her be for now. Convince her to help fight zombie. Yeah, let's, we need her help, right? Linwood tries to lay on the charm and get Keely to help. Keely sweats visibly. Can't you see I'm busy? I'm busy doing shit. You gotta go. You have to try. Might have worked on someone who was less of a jerk. So our wits and attitude are pretty good, I think. Sadly, that person seems like they're going to be useless, but let's see what's down here. Bathrooms may have drugs. I like the little flashing maple leaf on the alarm clock at the top left, by the way. Let's see what's over here. Uh, Z, that's pick up, and X was attack. Okay. Choose your pals wisely. Then one greets Ellen. I think we'll have to leave the safe house at least to get some rest for a while. Want to go to Canada? Yeah, let's get let's get, go to Canada. Let's go. Come on, Alan. Onward. We're on a death road to Canada, man. Ah, zombie. Whoa, it's a long wind up. There we go. Zombie is taken care of. Easy peasy. Always be looting. Every time, everywhere there's a little flicker, it looks like that's a lootable object. Awesome. Oh, your uh, allies can loot too. Cool. So we have bullets for the guns we don't have. That's always good. And this door here. Watch out for huge swarms. In short, don't go up there, I'm assuming. Ooh. Wait, are they breaking through? Uh, I say we just leave then, right? Uh, space for space, 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 trigger, start. Oh, cool. Oh, neat. Okay, okay, awesome. You can just uh, swap gear in between. There's loot, status of everyone. All right. She really wants to see a moose. And I can't hit a zombie to save my life, apparently. Oh god, from behind? Oh, they didn't say running is often a better idea. Leader leads to outside, or ladder. Let's get the hell out. Let's climb on out. Hell yeah. That was the tutorial. Let's start. So uh, we can do custom characters. Oh boy, this will this will be an ordeal. We need a front shot. Gonna work on his. This is gonna be me. So obviously his first name is gonna be Dur. Or Doctor. Yep. Jeez. Going back to keyboard does not like changing between the two. Okay. So we're just gonna go Doctor at and his uh er, perk will be um he he's a doctor, so um you know he's gonna start with a he's gonna he's just you know what he is? He's just gonna be a surgeon, it makes sense. Um what is he? Um obviously charming. As we can hear from listening to me talk, I am everyone loves me. Now let's see if I can get a decent looking pixely blob of yeah good enough I mean hat no no I don't really do hats oh god this game does not Fuck. and there we go good enough not really accurate but it'll have to do so we got our customized character start a new game empty slot leader is going to be obviously me and my buddy is gonna be um Mont works for me Game mode, death road, normal mode. That sounds like a good time. You guys, pack a toque, and we're going to Canada. Let's go. Er, 
Er. Controls in this game are a little bit weird, but oh god, we're in a car. Doctor Ed hears rumors that Canada is a safe place, free of the threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida. Apparently I'm a girl. She decides to brave the death road. All right. Zombies get hit for extra damage if they are knocked down first. And weapons have... Let's hit the road. Doesn't look like there's any controlling going while we're driving, but let's see. The group spots an abandoned Yalmart. Off in... Oh, fuck me. Looks like it's been looted, but maybe there's some untouched loot inside. Your zombie forecast is warm, mild, sluggish... Oh, hell yeah. We're gonna go bargain hunting. We're equipped. Monty, everyone... Gas. I guess we don't really have anything else. So, uh... Sure, what the hell? Let's just go. Let's boogie! Cleaver's fucked up. This music's way too happy for a zombie apocalypse. Ooh. Man, we gotta get an actual store, though. We're gonna get food. We're gonna get a. We're gonna check out over here. It looks like we will need gasoline and whatnot. And where else to find better items than in the Walmart or Yalmart back room, everybody? Come on. Oh god, we're getting tired and apparently maybe fucked up a little bit. I don't know how to keep track of health or anything. What I do know is breaking boxes might grant me something. Piece of wood. That's what I'm looking for, obviously. There we go. Let's see if we can just start breaking this stuff down with a piece of wood, if nothing else. It looks like I'm just sweating buckets, by the way. So if you attack with too much vigor... Damn. I'm not sure if things break into items or anything, so we might just run around and loot this place a little bit. Is that a gun? Yeah, that's a gun. Bullets here. Corpse here. Over here is... Shitter. This music's way happier than it has any right being. Come on. Come on, best friend whose name I am forgetting. Ooh, toilet. Why there's fuel in a toilet, I'm... Not sure. Oh god. We might have pinned ourselves in the bathroom. Oh boy. The music's really... The upbeat happiness is throwing me off pretty hard, but you know what? This little Wally world seems more or less cleared out, so we can just skadoodle on out. Just don't mind me, zombies. We're just leaving. Uh, start the car. Floor it. Yeah, let's get the hell out. Found some food. Got some more gas, some ammo, some rifles, and we killed some zombies. Okay. It's nearly time to camp, but there's been a lot of signs of bandits today. Someone needs to be awake in case of an attack. You know what? I'll be awake the first night. Not. Feels pretty bad in the morning. My morale's gone down, but my loyalty is revealed, and we all eat a decent amount of food. Hope it doesn't rain. It seems to irritate that. That's weird. It meets a man trying to repair his broken car. He has no idea what the hell he's doing. I mean... Let's try to help him, right? I also don't know what I'm doing, but I waste most of the day, and my mechanical skills are shit, and my morale shit, and everything's shit. Oh well, we're gonna need, we're gonna need food though. Well, they have to fight under the noon sun for supplies. I mean, we have to. The group sees infested stronghold, lost safe house. Let's get the lost safe house though. I mean, I guess we can put that in there and keep the gun and mont size of things. We're fine, right? I like the local co-op because I do see the player two popping up quite frequently. 
I wish more games did online, especially indie, but I have no idea how hard it is to do any of like the network coding and whatnot, so... If it's not something you can do yourself, I guess you can't really call people out too hard about not doing it them. Damn, I was hoping I can sneak into the house on that angle. Safe here, are we though? Hmm? Maybe at some point y'all were, but not no more. Oh boy, screw everything about that room. Also, Mont is a goddamn beast of a man. Hmm. A lot of zombies and not as much loot as I'm wanting there to be. Like, so far our big haul has been two food, which is apparently half a meal. Three field, four... Uh oh. I think I just dropped my gun. Nope. I don't know how guns actually work properly, for being honest with you. Hmm. Oh. Oh god, ammo goes by super quick. No shit, though, right? Don't mind me, don't mind me, don't mind me. Just uh, sneaking on by. Grab a med kit, and we are sneaking through here and up here? Or were we just here? Am I losing myself right now? Oh well, I think we got enough, enough food for another day, so let's see if we can maybe find another house to sneak on into, like this little white one here. I don't think a zombie's bitten me yet, though. I feel like they should have. And this house is pretty, oh boy, pretty empty. Oh god. A lot of it, I feel like the issue will come when you just corner yourself badly. Like, I feel like I'm doing that a lot and just not getting punished for it yet. Noink. But we're getting med kits, which are bound to be useful, I imagine. It looks like nothing else in the study here. Oh shit, I think I actually took damage there. Where you tell if that's happened, I'm not sure, but you know. Junk. Corpse. Door. Master bathroom, probably. Food in the kitchen. Ugh. Sneak on up here. I think I'm bleeding. Is the pause when you're actually in there? It looks like there is an active pause instead of the time continuing on, which is good. Maybe. And that bathroom is basically looted, it would look like. Though this Hitler-esque looking zombie was pissing me off a bit. So let's just uh, skidoo on out. Looks like our bleeding has subsided for the moment. So maybe we can... Maybe just, just get out? All right? There's the alleged safe house. As we all found out, not so safe no more. Hey, we took out a good amount of them there. Got some food, enough gas, and medical supplies, so, um... Ooh, it looks like my heart's really low. Ooh, I don't like that. Campground the group sets up smells terrible. The source of the smell is a complete mystery. Maybe we just drive off with no sleep. We get out of the smell zone, and they get no sleep. I feel like leaving was the right choice. Oh yeah, it rolls up her sleeves and starts tending the runes. We lose a couple supplies, but apparently we are a little bit better. My medical increased, so I figured it should have been high. 
Uh, da -da 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 -da. This sub survivor group is extremely annoying. I mean, I am charismatic, so we're sending me. I'm very polite, after all. The group is just let me through the barricade. Yeah, damn right. And we're losing gas, like, nonstop, but, you know. Outside Canada, most civilization. Uh, you have no food left. The group runs into a trading camp. Oh, yeah, let's visit this camp. Oh, are we actively trading here? Hi. Man who's carrying many swords. They clank around as he moves, and I'll make the finest zombie slicing food. I'll sell you some. Cheap katana for five food. Not worth it. What about you? I'll carry okay, the best stuff. Chainsaw for uh, seven, or two molotovs for five. No. I need food too, bro. I sell axes, just axes. No. Sadly, I feel like we're gonna have to bank our uh, money right now. That's not our car. And we're gonna start the car, floor it the hell out of here. There's a dog. It's keeping distance, but watching. It's become rare. You have seven food. Yeah, feed the dog two cans of food. The group leader saw his name's Demarcus. He knows a good source of meals, and he's joined the team. I got a dog. I have to feed the dog now. Stuck in a ditch. The group is uh, close to getting car out when a roaming horde draws them near, and they must distract them. Oh, uh, siege alert. There's no escape. We have to last a long time. <laughs> Oh, my dog. Come here, Demarcus. I don't care about my best friend. You're all that matters to me, Dim. Come on, sneak around down over here, buddy. Uh, siege is over. You can escape. Okay, we're... Do you want to go back to the road? Yeah, let's hit the road. We're getting the hell out. Yep. We we found something, and we've killed some zombies, but you know what? We're running low on food, guys. The group feels inspired after surviving it. They, they're going to get the hangout. What do we What do we want? Morale and a random skill. Yeah, sure, man. Every day is a great teacher. Dr. Red's morale increased. Everyone's morale. My shooting went up. That's good. Dog got more fit. Oh, yeah, a puppy. Group sets up camp in the grocery store. Another group has been following them. Probably attempt to loot the place. Send someone to loot and have the others stand guard. I will loot. I bring back some food. Morale's gone up. We got nine food. Eight, six. Still a net gain. Still a net gain. Group fires, finds a gun range. It's empty. Pick clean. However, they find some shooting targets and a working pistol. Train one per- search for ammo. <sighs> we need more pistol ammo, I think. Mm -mm 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 -mm. The group is driving down a long stretch of road. Do you have nine food left? The group finds all they can trade with. We gotta ignore them, guys. We, we, we just need more food. We need to inventory all of our supplies. We got no time for that boring shit. My morale went down. Come on, Mont. We're driving away. Group takes a detour and uh, goes to a cabin. There's smoke coming from it. There's, oh god, another siege. Sure. All that pistol ammo we just got, we're using that right now. Apparently. Back to the meat cleaver. Oh god. Oh god. No, Demarcus! Demarcus! Where are you? Ow, ow, ow. Come on, Demarcus. Get over here. We have some breathing room. Not much. We can maybe thin this horde down a little bit.
Siege is over. Yeah, we're getting the hell out. I think. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 no! Your mission leader has died. Demarcus is the new leader. Get out, Demarcus! Do you want to walk back to the road? Yes, let's hit the road. Mont is not here. Just go. We left behind Mont. Wait, am I driving? <laughs> no. Oh, man. Dang it. I was hoping the dog could drive, but that's just going to be the first run of the game. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a full series of this, but maybe a few, another episode or two because it's stupid. <laughs> Okay. Again, I'm Dr. Thank you all for watching. I know it's a little bit off the beaten trail from the Zero Time Dilemma, but thank you so much. But as you know, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you tomorrow with even more. So bye for now, everybody.